Members of one Southwest Florida community have something to celebrate. State Representative Spencer Roach scrapped a bill that would have paved the way to build a thousand homes on a thousand acres in Alva. Gulf Shore Business Editor David Dorsey explains what's next. As soon as a group of local state lawmakers sat down to discuss forming a new stewardship district for land in Alva, they decided not to discuss it at all. They kicked the issue down the road, noting that a 120 plus page document was too big and too short a time to discuss here at Florida Southwestern State College. The Duke Farm Stewardship District would have given Neal Communities taxpayer help to turn a little more than a thousand acres of pasture land in Alva into more than a thousand homes. How? Florida State Rep Spencer Roach said creating the Stewardship District would help the developer avoid septic systems so close to the Caloosahatchee River. I think that's bad. I think that's bad for the community. I think it's bad for the environment and I think it's bad for the residents and bad for the county. What the Stewardship district will allow is a better way to finance that infrastructure and those utilities. But the people who live in Alba clearly do not want another thousand neighbors and they were ready to let Roach and the rest of them know it. Among those in the crowd, Alba's James Kennedy. You know, we're not trying to prevent people from being able to use their property or to develop responsibly, but the, the proposal that they have is is over development. Spencer Roach told me that he wants the community members of Alva and the developers and landowners to continue their own discussions about the future of Alva. I'm David Dorsey with Gulf Shore Business. All right, David, thank you for the latest business news. You can text GB to 239-498-8500 for a free magazine subscription.